Hi everyone. Welcome to the video tutorial of GreenCloud VPS. With you using the Windows operating system for a long time, plus the fact that you install more or remove application software on your VPS, your C drive, operating system drive, partition becomes more gradually narrow. The main reason is due to junk files and temporary files created by the software when operating. And this is also the reason why your VPS is slow and sluggish over time. So how to clean up the trash on Windows, so that your operating system is always as clean as new and works smoother. In this video, we will guide you to effectively delete junk files on VPS. First of all, log into the server as an administrator. Please refer to how to connect VPS via RDP at the link we put on the screen for more details. You open the Run dialog box. Enter the following command. Press Enter to execute. In the next window, press Ctrl A. Select Delete to delete all files and folders in this. You can rest assured to delete all. These are temporary files and folders when you use the software and the applications it creates itself. That's why you can wipe it without adversely affecting your VPS system. You open the Run window. Use the Prefetch command. Press Enter to open the folder. The Prefetch folder appears. Press Ctrl A to highlight the whole thing. Press Delete to delete. Every time you open a file, folder, or an image, the Windows operating system will automatically save the most recent operations in history. It is saved as a shortcut, so the size of these files is very light, only a few KB, so it will not take up much space. However, to keep the VPS clean, there are no redundant files, you should delete them. In addition, if you want to erase all traces, not let others know what you have just manipulated, open what files or folders on your VPS, this is probably a very good solution for you. You open the run window. Use the command recent places. Press enter to open the folder. In the recent folder, press Ctrl A. Then delete all the files and folders in it. You do not need to do a lot of software to optimize or support for this to do. Instead, follow the instructions above, combined with some instructions on how to optimize and use VPS properly. And the advice is should delete periodically, you should delete once a month. 